With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So here we have to show that the, these points are the vertices of a square. Okay. So let this point be A point and this point is B. Let this point be C and let this point be D. Okay. So as you know that this, the all sides of a square are equal and the diagonals are also equal. Okay. So that means AB must be equals to BC must be equals to CD and must be equals to DA. So these all sides must be equal. Okay. And also the diagonal that is AC must be equals to another diagonal that is BD. Okay. So here, so distance between or the distance between point A and B is can be find out by using distance formula that is given by d is equals to whole under root of x2 minus x1 to the whole square plus y2 minus y1 to the whole square. Okay. For two points say for two points say x1 y1 and x2 y2. So the distance between point A and point B is obtained using distance formula. Okay, so this is our side AB of a square. So this is equals to, so here we can write this as 4 minus 1 to whole square plus 2 minus 7 to the whole square. And this is equals to whole under root of 4 minus 1 is 3, 3 square is 9. Okay, and 2 minus 7 will be minus 5 square. Okay, so this will be 25 so this is equals to root 34 now distance between point B and C is given by BC okay this is equals to whole under root of so this will be equal to minus 1 minus 4 to the whole square plus minus 1 minus 2 to the whole square this is equals to under root of so minus 1 minus 4 is so this will be minus 5 square that is 25 okay and minus 1 minus 2 will be minus 3 square that is 9 so this is equals to root 34 okay now cd will be equal to whole under root of so distance between point c and d is represented as so this will be equal to minus 4 minus of minus 1 will be plus 1 okay to the whole square plus minus 4 minus 1 to the whole square this is equals to under root of so this will be minus 4 plus 1 will be minus 3 square that is 9 minus 4 minus 1 to the whole square is minus 5 square that is 25 this is equals to root 34 now distance between point A and point D is or I can write this as distance between point D or point A is equals to whole under root of. So this is equals to minus 4 minus 1 to the whole square plus 4 minus 7 to the whole square. This is equals to under root of. So minus 4 minus 1 will be minus 5 okay minus 5 square is 25 4 minus 7 is minus 3 minus 3 square is 9 this is equals to root 34 so here you can observe that AB is equals to BC is equals to CD is equals to DA which is equals to root 34 now let's check for the diagonals okay so diagonal is so diagonal AC that is distance between point A and C is equals to whole under root of so this will be minus 1 minus 1 to the whole square plus minus 1 minus 7 to the whole square this is equals to under root of so minus 1 minus 1 to the whole square is minus 2 square that is 4 minus 1 minus 7 is minus 8 
and minus 8 square is 64 so this is equals to root 68 now diagonal BD is equals to under root of so again using this formula this will be minus 4 minus 4 to the whole square plus 4 minus 2 to the whole square this is equals to under root of so this will be minus 4 minus 4 square is minus 8 square that is 64 plus 4 minus 2 is 2 and 2 square is 4 that is equals to root 68 so here you can see that the diagonals are equal and all sides are equal so that means these are the so a comma b comma c comma d are the vertices are the vertices of a square okay okay so this completes our solution for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today